Hi everyone, this is DeFi Dad. I wanna walk you through what it means to approve a spending limit in a transaction. Uh, it often is referred to as enabling DAI or enabling USDC. So if you go to the invest tab in Zapper, uh, any one of these zaps starts with us adding either ether or one of these other tokens. If we're adding ether, we thankfully don't have to go through any sort of um, approval transaction because just the nature of using Ethereum allows us to send any amount of Ether from our wallet, which is why you see the confirm button here. This will be one step to uh, kick off this zap and it won't require any additional steps. But if I flip it to DAI, now I have to approve DAI spending. So if I put in 100 DAI here, the first of two steps to actually zap this requires that I give permission to spend either, in this case, an unlimited amount of DAI, which would mean that if I came back to this zap in the future, I wouldn't have to go through this step and spend uh, some ether on a transaction. But me personally, I choose to put in exactly what I need. So anyways, I put in 100 because that's what I'm going to spend. And then I would uh, put in exactly how much gas I'm willing to spend, and then I would hit confirm. So this is a step you'll recognize in our zaps, but you'll see them across all Ethereum uh, applications. And that's anytime we're using an ERC20 token or a token that is on Ethereum that is not Ether.